the community center in nature is to help people in, in just different facets of their lives. We have everything from recreation to education to social service opportunities that we provide our families. Hi, my name is John Guth and I'm the executive director of the Ken Rock Community Center. I'm making sure that all the programming and the fiscal ability of the center stays sound throughout the course of the year. It's a community that knows everybody, they're, they're long standing in, in, the, in the neighborhoods and generations after generations continue to stay within that pocket of Southeast Rockford. We primarily serve all the way up through the 61108, 09 and 04 zip codes. The Junior League wanted to try to join two communities, the Morse Kennedy neighborhood community and the Rock River School community, hence the name Ken Rock, and that's how Ken Rock was started back in 1937. Demographics is primarily white, but we have a, a wide range of uh, ethnic families that use our, our facilities and our programs. I work hand in hand with a lot of organizations and agencies and a lot of funders, and it's important that we stay in touch with our community as well. We are a modest, uh, modest income type of community and that's what makes the community center so unique is that people know that they can come to the community center and I mean that's how I started when I was a child. Uh, life is a lot faster uh, now than it was 40 years ago but it was, it was a place to be. Everyone played and everyone participated and it was a great experience. A lot, of, a lot of families are intertwined through the community center. In 2008 we had to make a decision. We had to sell the building. We are now a renter back into the same facility. We still offer the same uh, programs and services. We just don't have the overhead costs that it took uh, that drained us uh, before. It was a good decision to protect our future. So now we focus most of our energies on programs and services for our families instead of worrying about how to pay the heat bill.